Hello world, welcome back to Subray 23's Thought Experiment. So today is something new that has hit in the last few days and, and there's definitely been a lot of noise about it. Uh, it is called holographic remoting. Microsoft has been really proud of the fact that this device is not tethered. Um, Wi-Fi, physically or otherwise. So now, but of course it's limited in power. Um, whereas remoting uh, is a way to allow to offload processing to a computer um, so I've got a simple scene here a uh, couple of squares couple of key, uh, spheres um, and this holographic simulation and remoting I'll get this loaded up we know what my IP address is and we will connect to it. So now I will hit play. And we now have Unity running directly inside the HoloLens with a very little issue. You know, you would think there'd be latency, but if you look at my head movements and and how they're re, uh, reflected on the screen there it looks pretty accurate um, there's definitely something going on with the um, it looks like it's layering two two levels one's moving and one's not interesting bug and of course this is going to be buggy it's a brand new process but it's a very cool process. I think this opens up the doors to do really big things with HoloLens um, using the using PCs as a back end just seems really smart but I just wanted to show this off and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!